There's a battle brewing on Long Island as a village is trying to get a moratorium on new e-cigarette stores. Officials in Lindenhurst say there are too many unanswered health questions. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan has a story, new at 5. There's a, a growing presence among younger people like myself. Enter the world of vape shops. Lindenhurst e-cigarette customer Albert Augustine. It's huge at work and uh, it's just, it's a growing, growing fad. Vaping lounges and electronic cigarette stores dot the landscape on Long Island's South Shore. Four dozen recently opened from Valley Stream to Southampton. One village now saying, hold that puff. Lindenhurst wants to attract more family-friendly businesses and hopes to halt any new vape, hookah bar, or marijuana derivative dispensary that sells cannabis oil. I would rather see nice stores and restaurants in, in my town than a vapor store. How do you feel about, about the vape shops? Oh, parents don't like to smoke shop. This is bad things. The shops are considered hip. Some are close to schools, libraries, and neighborhoods. Owners say the industry is mired in misunderstanding. I have zero nicotine in there, so I really vape only for the flavor. You know. And you quit smoking? Yeah, I quit smoking with that. I smoked for 20 years. So this is not nicotine, so there's no secondhand smoke that I'm getting right now? No, you have no secondhand smoke right now. Good. What flavor is that? This is Fruity Pebbles Donut. This is the new, you know, the new generation of smoking. Combustion is dead. Why are you here in the vape shop? I quit smoking cigarettes, so now this was the only thing that really helped. You should be able to open up your own business in this, in this state, country, you know. That's what we're founded on. Lindenhurst officials say they want a ban because of too many unknown, unanswered questions. I just want to be able to limit and control the ones in the downtown area. For health reasons? For health reasons. Currently, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration does not regulate e-cigarettes. A public hearing on the proposed moratorium here will be held tonight. From Lindenhurst Village Hall, Jennifer McLogan, CBS2 News. And officials there say that they're getting so much feedback, more than one public hearing may be scheduled.